Hello, welcome back to Elders Plays Dead Cells. I've done two episodes. This is the second episode. This is horrible. Uh, just miss me. Miss me with this awful start. Um, yeah, this. These couple of episodes are just me a getting back into the idea of recording with a sort of a stream of consciousness kind of. Uh, oh, just, let's just just get back the life that I complained about. <laughs> They heard me. Do the thing, bastard. Um, I am rolling and you are ignoring me. See, what they've done is they've just changed their behavior since the lawsuit. But then, um, they've altered their behaviour, so now they have another nuisance behaviour that I have to work around. Get my... I'm attacking you, but you ain't... <laughs> you ain't looking like you're being attacked too much there, my boy. Remember, you don't have to kill everything. <laughs> you don't have to attack these things. Miss me with that. Um... I was going on. I was waffling about how to use the rune. I haven't seen one of these for a while. Um, life is different and it's been diff more difficult to record. Because I have a paid employed job, I cannot afford necessarily, necessarily afford the time. This is a rubbish time. Oh, I suppose it's got a survival upgrade. Uh, I cannot afford the time to record when I have to... Uh, do, do the rest of real life stuff. I've got to do adult things. I roll. Oh, hello. I didn't even notice that was happening. I was too busy thinking. What do you want me to do here? I, I can't figure this out. <laughs> Help. <laughs> Oh my, platforming skills were already terrible and they just completely abandoned me for just enough time. I was thinking, when I get through this bit, I will... Please, stop being awful. When I get through this bit, I will heal. <laughs> it was not to be. Okay, give me a similarly good quality run and I promise that I will not make it horrendous. Uh, I don't know about this. Uh, basically, recording hard when you're not professional recording, man. Um, and I'm sticking to those guns, but um, I want to I want to keep the Minecraft thing going. We are doing more streaming. If you've noticed that there's a uh, I currently got Left for Dead going up. That was a stream that we did at one point. I uh, stream with different people at different times, so really I'm the, the only common factor in all of these streams. So uh, that's why you, you join. Don't forget, you can join new streams. I, I do advertise that I'm <laughs> going on live on Twitch. Uh, Rap. All bad. I'm not paying for it. Not maybe. I don't want that. Yes, I don't. Um, what have I heard? War Javelin Legendary. Heals all enemies with across the wall. Extra damage. Must be retrieved. Oh. <laughs> oh, I'm enjoying this. Nice. New, new, fun, new games. So, uh, I guess... What? What have I got to say? You know? New job, long way away. Very tired all the time. I'm trying to get back into doing things because I want to, rather than I'm trying to avoid feeling obliged in any way to do things. I. What? <laughs> I'm so confused. Why are we going? Where do you want to go? That's right. Um. But at the same time. I, I find that I've got a lot of... I, I'm trying to... I'm trying to muster more... 
desire to do things, and I'm trying to sort of break out of that humdrum feud state that it's very easy to get yourself into um, when you are just day in, day out. Right? Why can't I get through this floor? Killing a bunch of enemies uh, without taking damage. Everything is green. We're going green run again. It's turned out to be really good because of the number of actually decent um, weapons that do exist. The benefit from survival builds, which is more than I would have anticipated with that being. So there we go. That's good. Uh, yeah, I will take the take the noms, please. Um, I I'm learning German. I'm doing German lessons with a German tutor. So let's use this owl for some reason. One of the things that I really cannot understand is this owl. It's like the wings. What am I supposed to do with this? Uh, I'm just going straight to the problem now. I, I, I'm done. Let me out. I'm not even fast enough. Goodness me. Learning German. I've had one German lesson. And I have bought myself a book. A project book. And I only have to kill 30 of them as well. Um, why don't you give me this? <laughs> Let's see what this does. We haven't used it yet. Uh, don't want the tentacle because I've got a decent weapon. Use uh, this one. Money was good, but not that good. Uh, let's just do that. Let's see if we can parry. I bought a, it's a A4 bound with it's a ring bound folder, not not a clippy type put things in it folder, but a um, only parrying a melee attack. That's interesting. Might as well, yeah, I'll use this and then get this back because we're going to walk past it anyway. Um, it's a it's a pre bound hardback folder, but it's got a book. It's got metal bindings rather than stuck together. Have a fine. I have a problem with books. Let me tell you about books. This is going to be our topic of conversation. Today. We're getting back into this talking nonsense, which I'm into because one of the reasons why we play these games is that we get to not focus on the game specifically and just waffle on about anything that comes to mind, which is a skill, honestly, um, something that I'd like to practice because I was thinking about doing some uh, streams or more and more games and more solo streams. So if you want to join in those, keep an eye out on Twitter. There's a link in the description below for all of my social media. But really, Twitter and Discord are the only ones I actually use, which is to say, of the three, also, no enemies. Okay. Oh, yeah, get also, those. Uh, no, I like this owl. Um, I don't use Facebook, is what I'm saying. I don't really have any, any value in using it. Oh, I've got it. A bit left behind. I don't get it. I'm understanding the balance of this now. <laughs> Go and get it. Interesting. Uh, it's a significant change to. It's an interesting design space, I think. Oh! <laughs> Missed on the on the old parry there. Got it back, got it back. We're all right. There's something about this. I expect this skill again will anger the Great Owl. 131 damage. I'll dispose if you take any damage. So I can use it again. Right. When I last read that, I'm not going to roll through here, no. When I last read Anger the Great Owl, I assumed it would damage me. But actually, just, it's a bonus to not being hit in the time it takes to recharge the owl. Now it's an angry owl. Temporarily angry. Aha! And I got HP back, which I didn't need. That's okay. I want to go down here, but I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. It's hard. Came back for some reason. Nice. 
Um, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, the whole stream of consciousness thing is really useful if you want to do something like a solo stream. I was looking at this new World of Warcraft, um, the classic thingy. Now, it turns out, you don't really get know why I keep going up there and getting that key. I never use it. Um, it turns out, if you want to play it, you basically have a WoW subscription, as usual. WoW itself, WoW Classic is free, whereas the World of Warcraft, all of the uh, up-to-date expansions, etc., you have to be keep paying for them things, uh, which I ain't paying into, so, no. <laughs> um, and, but, it's amazing. I don't get hit by this. Uh, but, you... Basically, the WoW subscription, which you always have to pay for, you already have to pay for a WoW subscription. RB. Um, now it gets you Wild Classic without having to pay for it on top. You don't have to buy the base game. And Wild Classic was like, maybe the first expansion was okay? When the top level went from probably 60 to 70. That's what we did, it? Um, no! <laughs> Trap me! Checkmate. Uh, yeah. The first one I think it took was from level 60 to level 70 to level 70. And that was fine. There was a little bit more content. It didn't really significantly change the game. It just added things. Right? Now, the whole game, I'm like, well, this is not the game I played. And, you know, the, it started in original World of Warcraft. And, um, I want some good grenades. Okay, it's not what I asked. <laughs> um, and just as I got to the max level of the original World of Warcraft, they brought an expansion and changed max level, so I never did the original raids. I don't really have a raiding party anyway. I mean, it wasn't part of a big guild or anything. That's awful. I don't even know why. Uh-oh. Where is it? <laughs> Give it back. Have I got it back? I'm going to go back. Um, let's just do this. Oops. No, it's okay. Ha ha ha. That's how you do it. Turns out, you just have to be a complete tool and get it wrong and right at the same time. And my other problem is you can't attack twice with this thing. So if the thing doesn't die, what do you do? Right? And I have to do this thing. You... I guess you parry something. Really. So the timing on that is all wrong as well. Okay. Give her the grace period. I hate those things so very much. Yep, you can explode. That's fine for me. Where is it? Oh, I picked it up already. Uh, uh, I was thinking, I'm still considering, but I'm not quite sure how much I'm considering playing this brand new World of Warcraft. Uh, brand new, brand old <laughs> World of Warcraft. You know? It's, um... Yeah, you know, let's get this bird out. Thank you for doing I'm, I'm a fan of this bird, by the way. I, I disparaged it when we picked it up, but it's just the other thing that I don't understand. I understand the bird. Run! I, on, I swear to god, the cooldown on rolling is the worst thing about this game. You know, I made a roll to get out of the situation. I got into the situation. Oh, hello. I, I was literally not looking. Everyone watching this just went, why just walk off the spikes? I, in real life, have gone, there's spikes there. What the heck? I was thinking, okay, I was... That was just rude. How many times have I told myself not to do that? There's me doing it. I was reminiscing, you know, I was thinking back to the good old days of when I first played World of Warcraft, introducing myself as a hunter. A night elf hunter. You know, because uh, I didn't want anyone to think I was not a complete and utter full on noob. Um, why not pick night elf hunter? You should not have. What have you been. Just helping you. Where's my ammo? <laughs> Give me my ammo. There you are. Can I breathe that? I don't think I need to breathe. Does this character require breathing? Do not know. Uh, I would like... Yeah, 
So I was thinking, well, it was fun the first time, and the same people were playing it with me the first time are now playing it again. Um, and I do remember getting heavily addicted to the Warcraft. But at the time, I was very different in many respects. You know? um, I didn't have a partner, let alone any responsibilities to said partner. But I, by the way, I chose these responsibilities. I have brought them upon myself and I accept them. But it means that you have to weigh up decisions against them. Decision that you previously made, which is to have responsibility. Oh, no. Um, last time I played World of Warcraft, you know, girlfriends happened to other people because I was sort of the person doing World of Warcraft. And then, on top of that, uh, my job, my living situation, all those things were more sort of shared, basically. I was living with other people and not really spending, like, being at home was no big deal. Um, I think it wasn't that interesting, basically. This kind of a melee weapon, by the way. I guess it's a throwing weapon. Not really using the shield, but it should be. <laughs> so I'm going to keep it. But. Oh, hello. Uh, so I'm tempted to play it because I think that on stream it might be a decent thing. And. This crossbow could be a better alternative to the shield, if I'm being honest with you, because if I have the war spear, which is amazing, when I don't have it, I need something else to uh, keep you going. What? <laughs> that was just a shitload of crits for some reason. Are you telling me that... Damage the frozen target. Why was it a frozen target? I don't know. Anyway, um, on stream, it's going to be a very grindy game. It's going to be essentially another thing I'm doing. Uh, streaming. How did you get there? <laughs> streaming the Zen Minecraft. And in fact, just any of the Minecraft, to be honest with you. Uh, would be the worst idea in the world. Because. It's something to do, you know? If I'm playing a game, I might as well have it on screen. Talk to everybody who's watching at the same time. Something like World of Warcraft, which is equivalently grindy, I'm going to have to be able to go off on these rambles. Which means if I can start... If I can sort of get the wind back underneath my wings in terms of... Um, uh, heavy weapons. Swift Sword is okay. Um, in, in terms of just talking it and keeping that going, then I'm going to be more confident do streams like that, which means that if I can continue along the line that I started with, which was, well, let me tell you about books, <laughs> and have spent about 20 minutes talking about something else in between, I think probably kind of there. Critical hits, I'm not having any. I like my bike. But let's uh, replace the crappy grenade with a decent one. Get this thing done for a while. Nah! Nice. Um, it's kind of difficult to read books. He says. Fully expecting to be taken out of context. What I mean by that is that books are not really designed to be held <laughs> in order to read them. This is the problem I have with books. I can read the words on the books. I can read English text. I can even sort of start to read German text. In fact, I can read the text. I have no idea what the words I'm reading are trying to tell me. So, baby steps. The problem I have is one of the physical mechanics of a book. I'm thinking of a softback uh, novel. I've been reading all the Discord novels. As you know, because we've talked about this Reading the Discord book has got me to the situation. Let's do the ossuary. Why not? Been here for a while. Um, but I have had to develop my opinion about. Oh, we've got these time books. Uh, about the nature of book. Uh, quite considerably. Because I'm on like 
20 something 30th maybe book by now i'm reading going postal which is probably one of the, the better books uh, of them all to be quite honest with you it's an excellent book i, I have no i don't even have uh, a <laughs> slightest bit of um complaints about going postal I it's one of the greatest books because it's excuse me uh, what down there why I don't know. It just it seems like there's a sudden turnaround in Pratchett where it feels like for a while he was not 100% certain about what he was doing and then all of a sudden going postal just comes out of nowhere. And what where did this come from? You know, this new character, new situation, new story, new era of uh, of the Discworld's Technological development. No, it's, I don't know. It's just there's something sudden about uh, going postal that I would not have anticipated. It's just a sudden turnaround and turnaround is fair play. I'm glad I turned this bird to angry mode. I'm thinking the war spear is not holding up a, in, in terms of the, uh, the the shield sort of thing that we've got going on here. I do think we should probably think about uh, sort of pivoting to using some... Basically, I need a ranged weapon or an alternative green weapon of some description I can use whilst I'm fetching my war spear, which has been amazing. Don't get me wrong, it's a really good weapon. It's just that... Getting it to <laughs> getting DPS in between trees is a little bit beyond me. You're all done. There's nothing up here. I have to go down. Oh, I'd already been down. Oh, I see. I didn't get this. Um, going for is a great book, and I did miss the truth because I don't have a copy of it. And instead of just not reading any more books until I can get a copy of the truth, I thought, you know, let's just read the next one. Uh, and essentially it's been going on like that for all this time I've been getting everything in as much order as I can except the first two which so really great and it hurts I can't I hate reading books I, I love reading and if I had them all on the Kindle I would not be making this complaint at all but also there's something tactile about uh, a, a real book that you just don't get from the Kindle although I do appreciate the, the Kindle the Kindle is an excellent piece of technology. The, I'm talking about the, the original one, but an original Kindle. Not a Kindle Paperwhite, not an electrical monster type Kindle. You know, it, is, it has uh, an e ink screen, which is still going. Uh, you don't get any better than this. No, 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 no. See, I'm not even going to try. And, um, I'm not going to try and parry anything if I can avoid it because it's going to go horribly, horribly wrong. So, get him. Um, but, you know, with all of that being said, uh, get him. No! I, what are you supposed to do in that situation? It can't be parried. <laughs> There, there's nothing I could do. No, I tried to jump. Ooh! I know that this is a shield, and we've got a lot of shield synergies going on. I can respec. Fuck this, let's do it. Let's see if I don't. I don't want. Yeah, I do. <laughs> is that colorless? Yeah, why is it breaking? Um. Sure. Might as well keep going with this. We're not going to do any parries for a while, but what we might end up with is... Okay. <laughs> I just sold the grenade that I could have used here. He's going to keep attacking that now. What if I turn it off? It's alive now. 
I need you to kill that so that you're not aggroing anymore so I can throw a new one down. Damn it! <laughs> we'll, we'll sit here for as long as it takes because I'm not going in there. Verbal game. I can just stay here. Didn't realize that. Okay. Meh. <laughs> something's something's found it. Again with these. I need to kill six things. So I actually forgot that I turned that on. That I'd, uh, that I've done that. Um, I'm a big fan of going postal. Yeah, most people are. It's gonna be hard pressed to find somebody who isn't a fan of going postal. I have the um. Not this is not why. <laughs> I was about to say because I have the uh, hardback copy time. I got it special. But speckle. Don't you dare. Okay, good. Um, wonder if taking fall damage counts. <laughs> Here you go. Oh, uh, I got it signed by Mr. P. Terry himself. Thank you, rest in peace. And it came with some genuine. First edition Ankhmore pork stamp. And a genuine Ankhmore pork envelope. Hooray, curse left your guy. Again. It's one of those situations again. I'm like, what do I do now? Okay. <laughs> again, there's no way out of that. I didn't even realize I wasn't a ground. I can't! Resist. We took that. Nice. Uh, no, I can't, you see, because I need the DPS. <laughs> Selling a lot of shields, which should be my main game plan, because I've chosen to go with this war spear, which is great, except for when the levels are big and open like this, and I can't go back and get it. I have to keep waiting 10 seconds to get my weapon back. Also, how long is this corridor of nowhere? Oh, no! Oh. But I can't hold these books open, especially while reading, you know, whilst I'm uh, in bed is where I usually read. My phone just went. Jen's on home. Jen's coming. Didn't lock the door, so uh, the dog is roaming free in the house. Available for anybody who walks in through the unlocked door to steal to that heart. And by all means, <laughs> she'll go with you, no problem. That is one trusting dog. Whoop. Try this again. Okay. Takes you so long to throw it, you turn around. Where are you? Oh, you got gone. Oh, that was easy. Oh, hello. Where did you come from? Thanks, Bird. Appreciate that. Ah, uh, we were going in this door. <laughs> That's what I was doing. Can't hold these books. Lying down in bed, and it gives me this cramp because I'm using my thumb to keep the pages separate. So the the page that I'm reading, specifically, that's expensive. All of that's expensive. Who do you think you are? I've got the. Um, I don't know if I'm the only person who gets this. The other trouble I seem to be having is that whilst attempting to read said book. Um, I, I can't see, <laughs> I can't read the words that are in the sort of crevice, sort of the middle of the book, in between the pages where it joins together, in the spine, but where the spine, like the inside of the spine, 
because I'm holding the book in this way, I'm not using two hands. Look, I know what you're saying. Hey, hold the book with two hands like you're taught to at primary school. You know how still to hold a book at primary school? This is for oration. You hold the book in your preferred hand, which is your preferred hand to hold a book, not in sorry, your right hand if you're right handed. Um, hold the book in a hand at the spine, and the spine rests between your thumb and forefinger, so that most of your hand is on one side of the book. And then... <laughs> First of all, no, what is this? Second of all, excuse me? Third of all, oi. Um, so you can actually stun them. <laughs> Working on the assumption that I can't. Uh, and then with the other hand, you put your hand so that your basically your forefinger, your first and second fingers, they hold the pace of And I'm going, okay. you want me to sit up in bed, restart, install Windows 10 update. You haven't been able to update your device. That's because I'm bloody well using it. Leave me the hell alone. This is left in storage. What? So I'll just leave. Oh, I've seen it. Give me a minute. Um. Go away! Goodness me. Books! <laughs> Thanks for knocking off my train of thought. I've mentioned before that there's a sort of an ADD consideration going on in my uh, life right now. Probably check out what's in here. Up there, maybe. Um, which is currently manifesting as when Windows update tells me that it's not been able to do what I don't want it to do is go away and leave me alone. Oh, I just can't remember what I was talking about, which happens to be the fact that no way when I'm... Because I read a book at night time because it helps me sleep, right? It's not uncommon, I'm sure. But... You know, the drowsiness that you feel when it is helpful for, for the, for the ooh, that was 30. <laughs> it's helpful for the, 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 the dropping of off you know, when you try to get it. But I have a problem with sleeping. Here we go. Now what? Yeah, I know. I have a problem with sleeping because Minor disturbances wake me up to the point where I can no longer fall asleep. So if I'm drowsy, which is doing me well because I want to go to sleep, I have to then put my book away properly. Like uh, I've been standing at a lectern uh, and then lie down and find a comfortable position, etc. Now I'm wide awake again. What I'm going to do is pick up the book in the lying down position. So what we want here is we want a not a better melee weapon. Not the. I'm not gonna re-roll this way because I'm. I need to be able to afford it as well, you know. I'm lying down in this position, trying to hold this book open. So what I'm doing is using one hand, because the other hand, when you lie down, one hand tends to be sort of utilised in the process of being being in a lie down position. Um, so one hand I have, quick, quick, to, uh, go. Nice. Which is hurting. This is the hand that's hurting now. So then, you know, I'm, not only that, but I've, I'm holding up the weight of a book, and it sounds pathetic, which... Honestly, it might be. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure. It doesn't sound very... It doesn't sound very... You know, grown up. <laughs> Are you an adult or what? You know, where's your... Oh, that's up there. We found everything that we... Like the stuff over here. I don't think there's going to be enough enemies for me to get to. Only 21. With 21 more enemies. Oh, this is just... I'm glad I went this way. Oh, not that glad. Leave me alone. Miss me with that. 
Whoa, black bridge. And maybe some more enemies down there. Hopefully we can get... I'd like to get to 60, because it hasn't been um, very successful. A couple of rooms. Now, uh, all I'm saying... I, I am pleading the publishing industry to have mercy. And, and think about those people who are trying to read while trying to sleep. I just shot him like that. Have a few. I really appreciate this bird, by the way. <laughs> I can stand way back on this one of these things. Uh, 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 allow me a book that I can open with one hand and not really worry that I'm going to break my. Because the weight of the. That's what I was saying. The weight of the book is bending my wrist, which is trying to hold this thing up anyway. <laughs> it's a very difficult thing to do. Hold a book sideways. I'm, I'm lying down on my side, holding the book with the wrong hand and trying to read it. Of course, I've got to get it in the light, which is semi-weak. You know, night lights are not that strong. It's not a night light. It's a bedside lamp, but it's still not that strong. 98 to 30 cells. You must go to the tailor's place located near the starting room. Oh, that'll be what the um, mirror is for. So, what have we got here? Ooh, that's expensive. We're gonna do that. Hillstone. Oh, that's. Yeah, yes. Uh, let's talk about something that isn't involving parries. Straight up that. There's no reason not to take that in my opinion. I will use it. Come on, send it out in the uh, in game. Blackbridge, I'm not gonna do this without getting hit. Don't even try. Don't even go there. Don't do think about it. Put it out of your mind immediately. It's only the concierge who done this before. We won't die, hopefully, unless horrible. I thought it was going to run out. Very surprising. Swarm 2 plus. It's not quite good enough to beat this owl, I'm afraid, because the owl is doing so much good for us. Flint. Who's Flint? Torch. Also, no. It's okay. Basically, while I'm reading this book in bed, I'm trying to decide whether to use my other hand, which is holding my head up or, or supporting me in some way. That's not that works. Um, or. Yeah, let's, let's put these in here. Why not? Oh, I just. Across the threshold, that's it. Wait, wait. Um, hold the attack to put the critical again. I mean, trail demon. That could be cool. We'll try and unlock that. Even this. It's not necessary. I'm kind of doing okay. I don't like the stilt village, so we might as well do the other one I don't like. It's at least a bit more interesting. Uh, actually, no. <laughs> Just remembered what's in there. Uh, it's not man's best friend, that's, that's for sure. I can't get on with it. And I, I don't want to buy all these... This is what bugs me, right? Anybody else... I know everybody's in this situation. Anybody who is not trying to make money is in this situation. Whereby... If you have any sort of knowledge about the way this or anything works, the whole world, you would not be... 
human being do not attempt to charge people for the reproduction of simple data. Okay? Help. I didn't see you. <laughs> Leave me alone. I do like that they draw aggro. It's a big deal. Um, a trap. That's important. I'm third, but keep up. Oh, nice. Hello. Please don't scare me when I'm playing a game. It's like scaring me when I'm not playing a game. I can't hear anything. I can't hear anything. Silly. No one stole the dog. I guess it's good. <laughs> if we, you know, had a problem with the dog, then. We'll probably claim on insurance. Yeah, we have dog insurance. Don't you? You don't have a dog. Then obviously not. But we have both those things. And it's probably a good idea. I'm not entirely sure if I'm into the idea of insurance, but. I can see how some things need insurance, but I need to sneeze. <coughs> Gordon Bennett. Hey. Insurance against certain things is probably a good idea, but I think it's hard to know what the difference is between insurance and just saving up, <laughs> right? Because what is dog insurance for? Well, it's for what happens if someone steals a dog. And you put all that money into the dog, and then, you know, you... Well, what was that noise? <laughs> I was just doing that air eh noise, and then my body went, snort time! Um, I guess it depends on how much you're paying for that insurance. Excuse me. I know there's fire here. Where's my fire? Um, I guess the real question is how much does the insurance cost? Because. Ow. Whoops. Right. Your. You know, you put this much money into the dog, all very well and good. And it wasn't any of my money, don't worry about it. I know, I know what I want, and it ain't a dog. <laughs> Never any doubt in my mind that I might someday be to become a dog person. Why do I keep getting hurt by these things? Not hurt that badly, but it's really ruining my ability to get um, 60 kills in a row without taking damage. We'll, we'll come back to that. Uh, dog. I have my item back. Please. I'm pretty sure I walked over there to get it. Thank you. Um. I'm really enjoying this war stream, by the way. It's very clever. Right? Ow. Ah! Not made that. Goodness me. That was a horrible encounter. It was one of those ones where you make a small mistake and it just falls out of control. There's nothing you can do about it. You just have to try and recover. Um, yeah, there's a lot of money went into the dog. Still does. Got bills to pay, got mouths to pay. Um, but the amount that the insurance costs on top of that is negligible compared to the amount that it's cost so far. Right? Yeah, that's the important thing. That's say this, this, this. Um, that wasn't worth any of the damage. It took. <laughs> terrible room. So yeah, I can understand that. You know, it's not like we're putting. When, if anything were to happen, the money that we get back would be considerably more than the money that we put into the insurance, but not considerably more than the money that we put into the dog. Right? Move! Where is my item? Very frustrating. Ah, 
Take it. Um, <laughs> what happened? Alright, good. Uh, didn't like that. I was trying to roll, but I think I was stun locked, which I don't think is something that we should be allowed to do. Can you stop stun locking me, please? Um, it's, it's not for me. No one asked for it. Stop. Can I breathe yet? I do like burb and I keep forgetting to activate burb, which is a shame because activating burb is important. Oh, burb. What have we got here? Anything good? Access to the editor. I think fire is coming from when we run fast enough. Uh, I forget what's that way. Let's keep exploring. We don't tend to not go that way. Let's do this. What was I talking about? <laughs> we don't know. Very funny. Oh, I like that. Thank you very much. Smash. You know, key. There's butter key. Key. We'll need. Uh, insurance. Why, why were we talking about insurance? I mean, yeah, dogs. Also... Just, I think the annoying thing is something like... It's like car insurance. It's a bit of a... A bit of a cliche to dunk on car insurance, but... It's there. <laughs> it's there to be dunked on. I think that's because it sucks. It's almost like the... The idea is that you can get on without the car, okay? It's preposterous. You, know, you, you can't live without a car in 2009. I mean, some people do, they manage it, they don't know how. But they do manage it. Uh, uh, um, good on them, for trying it. It's very loud, I apologize. It's not that much. Um, good on them for trying it. But it's very impractical. <laughs> it's very, very difficult. Because there's a lot to, there's a lot that you don't get when you don't have a car. Because the, it's got to the point where society is just assuming that you have one. As a result, if you don't have one, you, you can't fit into society, which is kind of the opposite. Of what you're trying to fit in, that's the whole point. One of the part of the greater, greater wasn't it? But at the same time. They won't let us because they're requiring things that are not tenable. Are you part of it? So you're dead. So what did we get? We got a new double crossbow matic. Yeah, colourless as well. Increase our movement speed. Burn, burning time. It's, it's just better. <laughs> it looks better and it is better. I'm, I'm down with that. I don't think we need any of this then, do we? Because we've just got a better thingy and I'm happy with the bird. I'd like to upgrade the bird further, but I don't think I can. Unfortunately. Um, as a result of the fact that it's almost, it's almost mandated that you have a car. Where are you? What? Where did it go? <laughs> because of the mandate that you have a car, the, the idea that you would not have one is it, not, not necessarily preposterous, that's probably a bit of a strong word, but... Um, it, it's like so expected of you in the first place that you'd think there would be more in place to assist with it, basically. You'd think it would be more recognised as part of the social necessity. 
whereas it's not. It's still very much an attitude of, well, don't drive if you don't want to deal with the you know, requirements for driving. It's just a short-sighted, uh, it's almost a 50s kind of attitude. Not everyone can drive, so if you really want to drive, you can do the things. And I'm not talking about the driving test, honestly, I think the driving test is, they're changing it in the UK. And I, have to, I, I hope it's for the better. They are allowing people to go on the motorways. Um, we're the qualified instructor. I think you have to have done a certain amount of uh, certain number of lessons, or you have to be at a certain level. Or something. But I always thought it was silly that oh hello, they weren't allowed on the motorways because the, the motorways are the easiest thing to drive. On, right? The hard bit about a motorway, to my understanding, is um. Merging when you come down the slip road. Okay, matching speed with the other vehicles. And then... Uh, um, uh, and not driving into them and then you know, finding a slot. Especially when it's busy. And motorway driving when the motorway is busy is awful. <laughs> motorway driving when the motorway is empty is cinch. You, know, you drive really fast. Put your foot down. And then... Oh, it's blocked out. It's yeah, that's okay. Um, you put your foot down and you go fast and then you get to the motorway off the slip road and there's nobody on it because it's quiet and then you just keep driving. It's as simple as that. You just keep going. Oh, it was lit up. I thought I'd done it. But I got 49. 49 is actually really good considering it's me playing. Remember how we started yesterday's episode? The previous episode? Or even the start of this one. This is the second one I've done in just this. <laughs> just this. Why not? A lot of money. We're not taking it with us. If we die on the next level, it'd be sad that we didn't do that. I really would like to get a shield back. That might not be enough, actually. This has got hard. This has got difficult. So, I'm not feeling confident. I shouldn't be feeling confident because I was so, <laughs> I was so bad at this game when we started. Um, but to get this far at all should be essentially beyond my requirements for feeling confident. Like, what am I feeling confident about now to get beyond the point where I thought I'd managed to get to at all? Your confidence is going to dwindle as you... As you get further and further. Further past the point where you thought you were going to achieve in the first place. At all. So here's me wondering how we're going to get the next level I should be just grateful that I got to this level based on my performance at the start oh what the hell you can't do that did you see that they just threw up an enemy it's like the bloody scorpion why you didn't have to jump that far I didn't want you to jump that far you, just, you landed where I wanted you to land and then took a step it's not necessary mate stop pissing around why did my thing go? Why did it just fall through all those? Oh, it didn't. It just looked like it did. Where's money? Give me a shot. How much is spending? Oh, mate, you do do my head in so How long the cool. Oh, what? I thought he was dead. My bad. Alright, you're a fool. We get in the war spirit a bit of a, <laughs> a, a misstep a lot of the time, to be honest. There we go, you draw aggro. One, two. I can see you. What are you? You're. I did see you. Excuse me? Hello? Back. Where are you? Oh. <laughs> I'm not a fan of that. I think they died. But where is it? I do believe it was the... Yeah, that torch is now a lot less wibbly-wobbly above it than it was before. Anyway. Goodness. <laughs> this is hard. Whew. 
basically saying I don't think it's your channel. Uh, when driving. It's, it's ridiculous. The insurance on a vehicle can be more than the price of the vehicle because it's not related to the... This is something it took me a while to understand, actually. Not related to the price of the vehicle. It's related to you as a driver because it's not related to replacing your vehicle. It's related to replacing the vehicle for the person you break with the car you break, right? If you drive into somebody else, it's their car that needs fixing. So your insurance is based on the cost it would take to replace the car that you break off somebody else, not on the car of your own. Which is essentially irrelevant. You know? If you break your own car, then that's on you. It costs you what it costs you. There's no price on that. There's no, there's no obligation on that. You don't have to replace your car. You ruin your car by driving like an idiot. Where did that come from and why? Why are these things so hard to kill? So I owned it, but it's still it's dead. I need that back as well. That's all I needed. That's why my crossbow matter. Back with you. Bell tower key. I'm like, oh, there's a blueprint in there. But the bell tower key is such an idiot, stupid bastard to get. I know there's only four bells, but bringing them in the right order. Also, why have you sent me up this way without. Is there one there? Hang on, what? I'm not, I'm not trying that. So if you are, yeah, here's one. Okay, cool. I'm okay with it. There was, there was a teleporter. I stank for it. That's third party insurance is basically if you hit somebody else. Comprehensive insurance. I mean, yeah, sure, I get it. There's different levels. Of uh, some of which are more designed to protect you from yourself than you from other people, or other people from you. It's never you from other people. It's silly, you know. I mean. I'm trying to figure out how to ring a bell. Stop. Oh. Oh, well. This is not a good place to put that. Okay. Go bed. More killing. Less standing around like a man. That wasn't fun. The game's supposed to be fun. Why isn't it fun? <laughs> Why is it too hard? I don't like it. Please don't surprise me with any more of those fire things I've never seen before. Even though they seem to have one attack. Ooh, hello. Charge you. <laughs> Ooh, hello. The uh, famous attack of... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. It's happening. I wasn't supposed to happen either. Oh, it wasn't supposed to happen either. Oh. Uh, why are you teleporting now? Hooray! Well done, me. Ruby amulet figure. That's. Let me take a look. Poisons enemies that wound you. It's not as. It's kind of a. Oh, hello! You. Haha! <laughs> Okie dokie. This could be good. I've really. I've always just bought insurance on the principle that I need insurance. And if I buy comprehensive insurance, it'll be fine. eventually come back it's just you want to go and get it really
crit bow do something? Do one more arrow. Now we've got crits going. Then maybe we want the thing that does crits for us. I don't know. I mean, insurance in the game is always going, hey, I, I need insurance, so I will fight. But, like, I'm the best way to do it. <laughs> Put it in, compare the market back up, and then buy whatever sense is achieved. Oh! He got me before I could get uh, enough crits on him to kill him before he got to me. Bit of a catch with it. Uh, better owl? Better owl. Same owl, but better. There's nothing I could do, dude. Do that back. So maybe there's a, a trick to buying insurance. They keep advertising the direct line, and if, I don't know if you know this. Not everybody in every country will know this, and of course, not everybody in the UK will know this because not everybody in the UK is constantly having to try and figure out how to get a better deal on their car insurance. Not everybody has a car, even though it's very important. Um, but if you don't have a car, or if you don't listen to adverts, which is fine. Honestly, I've started listening to the radio again. Simple and sole reason that I now have a digital radio in my car. But if I didn't have a digital radio in my car, then I would just be listening to my MP3 player, which is also kind of annoying because it's an MP3 player. <laughs> Showing my age there. I actually literally mean MP3 player. What I mean. Why? What I literally mean is, um, MP3 somehow on my phone. I get this. But even that's pesky because we bought a radio for Jen's car a long time ago, quite a while ago, and this radio. <laughs> Um, I mean, I got the key. What do you want? Have I found all the bells yet? I don't know. Let's have a look at the map. That's where they go. Very tall tower, dude. It's a bit there, I see. Uh, let's go here. Um. And it is a, it's a Bluetooth ring, which is to say it has a Bluetooth connection. Oh, that's not cool. Um, which in theory allows you to plug your phone in. I told you this. Not plug your phone in, but connect your phone, like pair your phone to the radio. It uses Bluetooth audio to, uh, To, to play the music on your radio from your phone which has been on it because it's 2019. Where's my ammo? Where are you, ammo? Over here? Did I get you back? I might have got you back when I was looking. It's very confusing. Um, but what actually happens is it works for a while and then the whole thing explodes with an almighty bang. I don't mean it literally explodes, but it pops all the speakers extremely loudly. Uh, which is distressing to say the least and then um reboots <laughs> the radio the radio reboots this is another thing like the, the propensity of modern devices to just restart and reboot and, and have a lot of electronics in them i'm just wondering do you need this level of like the way you see that um but ATMs are running Microsoft bloody Windows, you know. Just... Where is the attention to detail? Where's the level of... Where's the security? Where's the... the, the... I don't know. The, the craftsmanship. Anything. It's just thrown together out of weird random bits. Whenever I plug my phone... So, the phone in question, the, the radio in question, has... Bluetooth, which has this problem with it, and then 
floor, isn't it? Okay. I don't like it. Oh, oh there is. Hello. Rate of weapons. Are the guidance okay? Interesting. But no. Um. Yeah. Don't want that. If you plug it into USB, because you can also plug it into USB, and USB is one way of, of doing this, um, connecting in order to play music. So it, it will... When you use... Bollocks. When you use blues, it, um, it's as expected. Throw it! There we go. Not only plays the music, but it has the the, the feature that it also. Nope. Run away. Uh, it tells you what you're playing. You're listening. I literally just lost my bird. What's this? I, I, I think the important thing here is that we have the um, fire and downward smash. Actually, going to be. Whoa! Extremely important. Not that fire. Because we're also doing oil somewhere along this line. Stop! <laughs> Leave me alone! I kinda need to get rid of you. Pain in the ass! Forgetting I've got this bow, which I really need to put more use into because helps. <laughs> it's really important. Uh, no. Oh, that's a really good weapon. Actually, less DPS when I'm critting. Although it's kind of slightly easier to enable a crit, except it isn't because the things I'm trying to enable crits again are doing me dirty all the time already. Got it? Oh, God. Come back. Two kebab bobs. What? Did that just die? I'm so confused by those things. I'm basically permanently in panic mode. And therefore they die and I'm going, but I wasn't paying enough attention, I was just trying to survive. And then it's gone. I do like to send you slices sometimes, but this is not one of those times. Right. I want to unlock that thing, so let's figure out where these bells were and what order to bong them in. I wasn't paying enough attention because a lot of the time the bird was just making a noise, right? Do I do the lowest one first or the highest one first? I guess this one is probably near the uh, downstairs, right? What? <laughs> That sounds like the lowest one. We've got the highest one in the second tower, the lowest one in the first tower. Is there one down there? There might be. This is important, okay? Bear with, bear with. We're going to go this way. Now look down here. I think there might have been one on the way up. So where did you come from? Extra enemy, that's one enemy since so we hurt. What? That sounds like the second highest? I can't remember what the first one sounded like. Okay, so is that one higher or lower? Why is it so difficult to get to it? <laughs> It is higher. So this is the second one, maybe, or the third. I think the lowest one is the last one we want to do. Do you agree? The lowest one is the last one we want to do. So the lowest in position, <laughs> not the lowest in pitch. That's very confusing. One up here. Where? <laughs> Where? Oh 
gone past two teleporters, I could have found it. I didn't need to. The one at the top. Could have gone to the top teleporter and just come downwards. That's the highest one, by my reckoning. So, in between the two teleporters. One here near this door. No bell on the actual thing, so. So let's go and do the lowest one. We know that one. And I believe it's the second tower. We're gonna go down. We're gonna go to this one. This is the lowest one. Please be correct. <laughs> just just drop the key. Why? That one. Then the second tower is the next one. Which is up here. Almost not worth doing the teleport. I have to climb a bunch. Then I believe the next one is actually all the way down there, which is right Royal Rumble because I can't be bothered. <laughs> Come on. I'm gonna be a little bit miffed if that one turns out to be higher pitched than the one that is actually right up here. All the way up here. Why? Why are you like this? Nope, that was correct. Oh, good me. Well done. You actually got it right the first time, which is important because if you remember a long time ago when we first encountered this puzzle, I didn't even realise there were different pitches. <laughs> it's really very, very obvious how to do that. Uh, if you're not me, we have won a new blueprint, which is actually, it was worth it. You know, now we're, we're, we're making progress with the game. Uh, I actually don't need to do that. Much right here. We're making progress in the game, but we're pushing forward to getting all the new stuff. And then we're going to start with an even more eclectic and random and awkward and difficult and annoying set of starting items that we don't know what to do with. Let's have a look at the shield then. Oh, we've got two two things in the same one. Kills an enemy. Invisible. Does that? What does that do? But attacks and inflict damage on nearby enemies. I like this. It's basically a blood shield, but like slightly more focused, I guess you might say. I will spend the money on this. And then we do get this, which is... I am very grateful. <laughs> Thank you for always having one before a boss, if that's what's happening. There might not be one before the final boss, but if we even get to the final boss, don't forget, this this uh, fight here is going to be super difficult. We don't have any way of um, pinning this, this Joker down. Our only crits are in the... Uh, we didn't bring any sort of uh, shield, which I did try to use it now. Oh, this um, this this little thing on the ground here is doing gangbusters on this. You know what, we don't need the owl. Never mind the owl. How do you avoid that? <laughs> Without just dying. Oh! That single thing won the entire fight for us. I, d I don't understand why this pop master is so squishy. Quite honestly. Time keep it's, it's gone. <laughs> we didn't need any of that. I don't need to worry about that too much either. Light speed. I don't necessarily need this grenade, although it's not as good as... It's a good grenade, it's not as good as the things I've got. I think that's the thing that we're going to be dealing with here. It's not that good. It's an hour and a quarter episode because I did so badly at the start of it. Fortunately, apologies for that. But at the same time, we just beat the Clockmaster without really any cause or concern. We just crossed another milestone of that as well, which 90% of the items that we're going to be dealing with are going to be plus quality. Now that we've, when we find them. And then we're going to start on the next tier of that thing. We dash forward and inflict one hit, one damage. And it is a power, not a weapon. 
Activate again to dash back. That could be really cool. And we get this. We did use one thingy in all of that, but I still I can't fit the patterns of the clockmaster in my head. Plus, the the dash attack that it does. If you manage to dodge the uh, the grapple attack, well, well done you. But um, even then, there's the uh, there's the the next. You, know, you, you then have to worry about the fact that you've got to be the. Uh, I'm very um, If you dodge the grapple attack, then we're all very well and good, but then there's that triple dash attack. Very frustrating to deal with. <laughs> um, we really should redo our mutations. I'm not quite sure how to redo them. Oh! What timing is this? Yes. <laughs> yes. By gum. And we can start taking a shield. Ooh, that makes a big difference. What does this require? Moonflower key. Uh huh. <laughs> okay. No. You know, can't have moonflower keys. So now we have to change our playstyle completely because I can't remember how to. Anything other than what we've been using for all this time. Uh, the only thing we can really benefit from right now is something better than the owl, because, and it would be better because of the fact that it's yellow. Uh, it is green. What am I saying yellow for? Something is giving me a yeah. I'm getting HP when an enemy dies. We're also going to get HP when uh, Harry is the king of find ourselves. Let's go to the field. See, every now this this level goes from everything is fine to everything is not fine very quickly. A lot of the time it's because they like to put invisible enemies here and there, but most of the time it's because I don't know how to deal with all these enemies that I'm fighting. Um, remember, you don't have to fight them all at all, but knowing which ones you do have to fight is essentially guesswork. You know, you're trying to figure out where to go. You're going to need to pick up two keys, and the way you pick up keys... I, I, honestly, I think I need the HP. Um, the only way you pick up keys... ...is by... So many... ...arrows available for this weapon, which is amazing. You only have to pick up keys by fighting those elites in the coloured sections on the other side of the world. I mean, I can just stand back and do all this, quite honestly. As much as I uh, enjoyed the war sphere, uh, I think that our correct course of action here is to use this melee now available to us. I don't even know if I need to be a bit. I need to bait you into attacking me. What are you doing? Oh, God. Come on, bird. Do the day. Go on, harder. Nice. The fact that there exists an owl that just does a whole bunch of crossbow damage. Very strange. I don't mean to do that, but at least I got out of the way of the thing. But there's yet another enemy whose patterns I am completely incapable of dealing with. That was okay. <laughs> just, just keep going. Don't worry about it. Not cursed. Not useful. Oh, well, it is. I'm sorry, Bird, but I will leave you here just in case, because the Ice Grenade has so many advantages to specifically me, <laughs> and also, remember, there is water-based advantage we had in the, um, in the, uh, I rolled! 
water-based advantage within the the areas where the elites are in some of them. I can't remember which colours I want to fight, mind you. Anything good in here? I think so. So, having a, a frost majigger. I just think it's gonna be the, the best thing for it, right? Why is this hitting two? Have I got shots pierced the first target on this? Quick bow. Yeah. I mean, what more could I ask for? 15%. I'm not at 15% down. Why would you... <laughs> Just... be good, except for the fact that it's completely the wrong build for me. So thanks for making me fight my way through there. I don't need any HP, so I will leave that there, because that's going to be a big deal. Pizza. I have no doubts about that. Does it stick an enemy with the arrow, even if the arrow went through that? Good question. Away. Now I have a lot of damage taken. See that? Did you see that? He tried to. Run. <laughs> I think I will now take. Oh no. We're doing enough damage to other enemies. We're killing them fast enough. Sort of. With relation to our uh, the amount of damage we're taking, especially when we can do things from a distance like this, the, the, the deaths of enemies are actually just straight up going to be enough. Uh, I think the red one is probably the hardest. Let's go in. I don't know. I forget. Why have you crashed? Oh, you haven't crashed. I was going to get really upset. <laughs> Game enough. But it's okay. Just so careful, what are you? seems to work okay. I want to go and find out what the uh, patterns of this lunatic are here. Right. Okay. Oh, okay. Good practice for the boss. Didn't go too far, which is nice. There's a range on it. <laughs> Not always guaranteed. keep uh, doing damage faster than we're receiving it, then we will heal because of all the kills that we're doing. And you are those things. There is water, so let's go. Keep doing it. This is fine. What's the this thing? Have my grenade back, please. Dun 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 dun. Great. That was easy. <laughs> that was so much easier. I'm glad I did this one first. Because. It could be one of the harder ones for Oh no. Don't want that. It must stick a, an arrow in it, even though it's uh, 
Um, what do you do here? <laughs> the way out? Might be a way out or something. Uh, even though it's pissed the first one because of how that, the damage. You get crits on the first one, even though it's after it. No, is it worth anything to me? Yeah, I don't need to go over there, so I'm not going to. <laughs> you can't make me. This has been fine. I, I think I've done really well so far. and I'm, I know it's been a very long episode, and that is, as mentioned, because the first half of the episode was me uh, playing like after the track. But after that, I go. Hello. I think that's timed so that you can roll out. Uh, you know when it attacks you in two directions and then turns around? Ooh, hello. Be where you were for the third one. That's sort of this way. <laughs> um, I, think, I think it's probably timed for the third one. You can roll again to be on the other side of it. That's not necessary. Thank you for this. I wish it was full health. <laughs> it's not. Um, yeah, more HP. It's very important right now. And we are now back where we were. There's actually a door there that I just completely blanked. Go over here. Go over here. This is probably a good time to take this, because we're at like 50% HP now, which is low. For sure. We only have to kill this one, but we also have to find the way out. I th think... Oh. I think this one is... Is blue... The, uh, the, the Sonics, or is it the other one with the, the big stompy guy that I don't like? I guess we can always just run away. <laughs> That's going to be my plan. Uh, if I don't like it, I'm leaving. Generally, my plan is uh, I long ago got over the idea that I have to modify people for their hospitality. Your party is bad. If I'm uncomfortable for any reason, I'm gonna go away. I don't have to stay here. It's, it's not for me to uh, make sure that you feel good about your party. Wait. Don't get it to Oh, I didn't know you were gonna climb up. You see, you just climb up for no reason. It wasn't. Oh, no. Okay. So the blue one is not where we want to be. <laughs> Good to know. I assume it's the same each time. I believe it is. So let's go and get our uh, Sonic the Hedgehogs beaten up. It's two of them, right? It's two Sonics. Probably. I never forget. I can never forget. Do all that Throw another one in there. Yeah! <laughs> That's funny. I'm getting heals. The heals are good. Nice, nice, nice. You can have this because I want to deal with you. Okie dokie. I'm going to deal with you. Ow! <laughs> I didn't know that I reached that far. Okay then. We are hemorrhaging damage. Uh, we do have a full flask, which I have only just considered as an option. <laughs> so that's okay. Use our skills a little bit more prodigiously than we have. And especially since the slowdown of some of these enemies. There's so much time to throw um, a great number of uh, quick shots in. in the quick bow. A lot of damage on there, attacking nothing. <laughs> Down! Oh my god! It's like sometimes I, I genuinely 100% I STG. I was pressing down and jump, and he just jumped. This happens so often, and I'm struggling. It's not just me. You know, I thought I was the one who was bad at this game, but I think my actual character is bad at this game. Uh, and, and it's heartbreaking because he's the hero that Gotham needs, right? And this is the hero that Gotham gets. And 
what, what can I do? If this dude can't even jump up a... Like, it's his one jump. It's like, what's the point here? It's not like... It's... All I need him to do is perform the tasks that I am requesting of him by means of the controller. And he seems to have some trouble doing that. So, again, I don't want to sound complainy, although I, I have to do it. Just wear it, right? Uh, but, dude. <laughs> when, from earlier on, like when you just stood on the spikes, you landed perfectly where I wanted you to land and then decided to take a little bit further uh, and try the spikes out. That's your next little game that we're playing. Why, why is there an Inquisitor for you? I, I didn't wake up this Inquisitor. So, uh, uh, like a refund on the past couple of seconds. That's not very helpful position to put that. If I'm being honest. Right, these aren't helping because of those things. Get out of it. Luckily, it's a reasonably easy to kill. Provided it can be hurt. There we go. I didn't like that very much. It's not... Even not too clear, get gold as well as no. It's just not good enough. <laughs> it's really not good enough. I could have ignored that enemy, it turns out, because we didn't have to go that way. This um piercing shot quick though is just It's not the fastest at dealing damage, but it's just stupendously good at killing things because I can be so far away from it. From them. You know? Phone why are you buzzing? My move in chess. Hi, Carl. Wow, it's 8 o'clock. Maybe I should get some work done. <laughs> kind of another problem with working at home in this situation. Is that sort of... You take some time off to you know, maybe record a couple of episodes. And then you find it's 8 o'clock at night and you haven't done your hours of the day. And you think, well, I only did. You know, the first episode was 20 minutes long. I'm not very good at this game today. <laughs> Don't stand in the space. Okay, good. Yes, 15% HP is what we will go with. Let's do this. There's no reason to do anything else, honestly. Ow. Keep healing from the damage that... Keep healing back the damage that you took, basically. Um, not the direction I needed to go in. That's okay, we've learned. I'm hoping that this is just, yeah, straight up the boss. We've done really well. Um, for saying that I had a 20 minute episode where I just died for no simple, easy reason, and now we're here about to take on the final boss at one boss cell, uh, without even looking like we're in a particularly horrible position. I think that's the, the weird thing right now. Is, this is all, this is down to me, basically. Um, done bleeding, interrupted. 20% damage. Victim is slow, all near and critical hits plus 20. Cannot be interrupted by them. Burn when they die. That seems better. Right. Now, the question is, do you, do we want to... We don't have a shield, which is annoying, <laughs> because we could now deal with one, but there isn't one. There's nowhere to buy one. I don't even think we found a shop on the previous floor, and if we had, we would have been sort of throwing ourselves, which means we should definitely reset mutations, and the reason for that is that we haven't got anything to parry with. There's no point taking mutations that aren't used. We'll take extended healing. Well, let's take necromancy because we know that it's gonna. Is it? 
there's not that many enemies and it's 0.52%, which means the five enemies is going to go for a tiny amount of... Uh, the five elites is going to record... It's going to be a tiny amount. Of it. Um, Using health potion grants DPS of 12 seconds. Yes. Vengeance. Yes. Thing is, I'm not interested in things that involve killing an enemy. Because there aren't very many enemies to actually kill. So we want to do things that... Basically taking things that give us something. That's perfect, by the way. Just one health flask. We're nearly at full HP. We should have eaten that uh, kebab and it would have been perfect. It would have been absolutely... But if I die by that sliver of HP, it's not going to happen. Just based on the mechanics of how death works in this game. Is this still... This King's still dead. <laughs> why, are you, why are you even here? Mate? Leave it alone. Hand of the King is still there. The King is dead. I'm going to be very quiet during this, <laughs> uh, which is common, so don't worry about it. Oh dear! Nice, okay. Alright, stage one. We are through stage one. Honestly, I don't even know if I want to uh, like, redo the. I'm always thinking about the. Um, the uh, what was I, I forgot what I'm saying. Um, the, the, the effects on a weapon. Do I really care? Hey, what? You used a shield. I thought you charged me, but you didn't charge me. Going on. I apologize for my silence, but I think it's helping, so let's just leave it. Stop it! <laughs> it's mean. Why are you all gonna be so mean? Right. I don't think there's any point right now in. That's say... it. <laughs> oh, you're that one. I thought you were the gravity one. Oh no. I mistook it for the one with the hook, so I dodged out of the way of what I was expecting to be a hook. And I was like, oh, as soon as I realised, it was too late for me to readjust what I was about to do for the fact that it then threw another boomerang at me and got me because I was about to try and land and use my last piece of flask, which is really annoying because I had a last piece of flask. Oh, why? That's such a frantic fight because I can't see what's happening. I can't, <clears throat> can't brain it, you know? It's very similar to the clock tower where just seeing what's happening and reacting to what's happening i i just don't have how many times have we been there like never um i don't think shield and ranged attack works too well so let's let's try this for the next episode thank you for watching we'll see if i do another one it's not going to be right now um but i just wanted to have a chat see what was up with the channel see why videos have been so infrequent and it's because i'm kind of busy and i don't like it so <laughs> 
Thank you for watching, and I hope that I will see you next time. Bye.